find the one you love, gotta make sure that you love them right. Yeah. When you find the one you love, gotta make sure that you love them right. Yeah. When you find the one you love. I got a girl that compliments my fly. And when it goes down, I know she gon' ride. Hey there Bombers and Bombshells, it's your girl Claire and today we have another exciting episode of Fashion Bomb TV. We're at Atlanta's luxurious Phipps Plaza at Press to interview Rashida. She's a reality starlet, a fashionista, and an entrepreneur. We can't wait to learn more. So hi everyone, we are here with Rashida. She is a reality starlet, a fashionista, a rapper, an entrepreneur. We're here to interview her about her career and learn a little bit more about her. So, hi Rashida. Hello, let's cheers. cheers. <laughs> so let's talk about Rashida before 11 Hip Hop. A lot of people might not know you're an accomplished musician and all that you have done in your career. So can you tell everybody who might not know a little bit about that? I've done music like since I was a teenager. Mm -hmm. Initially started off in a three girl rap group, mm -hmm. eventually went solo, mm -hmm. what people, um, know me in the south four was my first hit which was the number one on billboard song called do it featuring pastor troy which was like a crunk classic atl hit then my next big record um was called my Bubblegum. that's where everybody knows me from um right. which was um platinum platinum single independent on d -Lo entertainment a lot of different stuff but yeah, yeah long time just grinding in these streets okay so a lot of people know you from love and hip-hop yes so can you tell us about that decision to do Love & Hip Hop and how has it changed your life for better or for worse? What's the best part about it and what's the worst part about it? Okay, the best part for me mm -hmm. was the fact that I had businesses so I made sure getting on a platform that I used that for a benefit. Yeah. The flip side, it's like no off day. There's, right. you know, every you minute, every time, you can't and... go anywhere, you can't do anything, mm -hmm. which it comes with the territory. So you have to know how to work that. Let's talk about Pressed, yes. because not only did you establish a store, but you established a store in the most luxury mall <laughs> there is in Atlanta. <laughs> right. So tell me about that process um, for somebody yeah. who's aspiring to do something similar. I originally started online, and I started my online store on Bossy.com um, six and a half years ago. Developed this brand, everybody knew about it, mm -hmm. and when finally being able to come into this mall, mm -hmm. they were like, we want you to change his name. I had to pray on it, because I was like, you know what, Lord, just let me know what I need to do. Right. And he was like, you know what, it's time to evolve, Rashida. And I was like, okay. Came up with the name and said, you know what, I'm a Put it, go out on a whim and just hope I can convert everybody over and all of my customers over mm -hmm. and I was able to. And you did. Okay, I have a few questions from readers. Mm -hmm. Will you ever start your own line? Yes, I've actually started already. Oh. Um, yeah, um, there's some in here I'm going to show you. What are the challenges of owning Pressed? People don't understand it's a lot of work. It's mm -hmm. a lot of hard work. Someone says, I have a friend who is going through troubles with her marriage. After 16 years, it is very hard for her. What advice would you give to her, any woman going through relationship issues? Um, first off, pray. Yep. Um, sometimes when we go through different things, we always want to blame ourselves for different things. I don't know what their situation is, but I had to come to realize to kind of sit back get my space mm -hmm. and just reevaluate a lot of different things. Because mm -hmm. a lot of times as women, we tend to put so many other things in front of ourselves. ourselves. Well, thank you, Rashida. I'm so happy to do this. Yay! I'm such a huge fan, um, and I love Pressed, so thank you. Cheers.